Welcome back, everybody. POA. So big thanks to my patron, Eric, who is turning sealed into reserve list. Um, got a little mystery box there in the uh, retail edition, which is much preferred to me over the convention editions. So we're going to pop this for me, and uh, I'm going to go into this, and I'm going to see what in the world we come out of this. Now, if I pass something awesome, I apologize now. There's way too many cards in this. I, I, don't, I don't know all of them, okay? But anyways, I like the retail edition specifically because admittedly the playtest cards weren't nearly as fun as I was hoping they were going to be. And I really like that extra little retail edition spot with the foils. I, I think that's actually, there's a lot of good pulls out of that. But we've got 24 wonderful mystery booster packs, and let's uh, let's go ahead and go through this. Let's see how we do, huh? This is such a such a neat product. It will definitely not go under the radar next time they do this. That's for sure. Uh, okay. So, going to be lots of commons, uncommons, things mixed all throughout. So, Dragon's Presence, Core Hookmaster. Embodiment of Spring, Mechanist, Scrounger of Souls, Noxious Dragon, so we get ourselves an uncommon. God, the card quality in this is so nice. Anyway, Hammer Hands, back to commons again. Cinder Hellion, Seal of Strength. The Conifer Strider, Thought Erasure. Spear, okay. Imperial Armor from uh, Weatherlight. I'm pretty sure it's not a rare, right? In Misdirection. You may... Okay. I think I remember that card. I don't think I remember that being that big of a deal. See? That's what I'm talking about. So, I know it's not necessarily a huge hit, but Lich's Mirror. So, we got ourselves a Mythic off. I totally forgot that slot was in there. So, we'll put that over on the side over there. I guess... Yeah, we'll, we'll just put the... Retail exclusive cards over there. Imperial Armor, I think that is in fact an uncommon. So I'll put that with the uncommons. Uh, you know what, let's, I guess we can track rares, that's cool. It's always funny when you hear people talk about these, it's like, it's got, it's got mana crypt. I'm like, you know what the odds are? Freaking terrible. Inventor, Venom, Skin Witch, Hellbearder, Blizzard, Guy's Blessing, Abundant Growth, Croesus Charm, Sandstone Oracle, Font of Mythos, okay. Boom pile, so two rares in that pack. And knowledge pull. Not the card we're looking to pull off of that. So far, I mean, it's only two packs in. So far, eh. Oh, oh okay, well, that, that is a cool card coming up. Not like a giant money hit, but it is a cool card. It's a card I've dug since it came out in Visions. Getting a lot of comments here. Okay. Constrictor. Crosenberge. Sweet. In fact, I'm going to create a little area just for that type of stuff. Juicy's Apprentice, which of course is Tomoya the Reveler. Or sorry, Revealer. So that is a rare from uh, Kamigawa Champions. Krenko. That is actually solid. And Teferi's Puzzle Box. Horribly, horribly off center, top to bottom, but, but sweet. OG. I shouldn't say it's OG. It's not OG. It's nothing OG about it. It's the eighth edition version. First off, second off, it's foil. All right, Seeker of the Way. Gotta love those random uncommons. Palaka Worm, 
Okay, Pollen Bright Wings. Thodion, that was an uncommon. Hackon, the rare from Cold Snip. Steam Flogger Boss. Goblin Rigger, huh? Form of the Dragon. Ninth edition. Wind Shards and Congregate to start us off here on the Uncommons. Fertile Ground. Okay. Nuck Levy. Okay, that's a card, I guess. Iron Shred Crusher. Sadistic Hypnotist. Goblin Char Belcher. Okay. And Colrath Knight, huh? That, that's when we get into, there's these cards, I just have no idea what it is. But so far, we are lacking any real strong pulls. Okay, Dragon Breath, Woodborne Behemoth, Crushing Canopy. Mist Meadow Witch, Soul Eater, Assemble the Legion. Yes, the Boros have to unite. Hey, Revel and Riches. That's okay. That's our first good pull, like actually good pull. And Glittering Wish. Very top to bottom on a lot of these. In terms of being off centered. Sleep. Sarkane's Rage. Unlicensed Disintegration. Benthic Infiltrator, huh? Hurricane. Good old Hurricane. Wheel of Fate. All right. I know that card. I know that card well. In Morrow. OG Morrow. Well, the 8th edition version, anyway, of the Mirage card. All right. We're almost done with the first, uh, first side, and this box is going poorly. It's going poorly. Plenty of randomness, though, to turn things around. I find it so funny to see elementals printed in this day and age. Armadillo Cloak. Dismal Backwater. Knoll Spine Dragon. Huh? I don't know you. Like, that is that whole period of time that I just don't know. Star of Extinction. From Ixalan, huh? I'm assuming that's a bulk mythic. In Gleeful Sabotage, common. Okay, well, let's move on to the next part of it. Wait, did we already do that? We already did that. Totally forgot where I was, even was. Crowd goes wild. And the crowd goes wild. It'd be nice if that was real right now in, while opening this box. Blade Wing the Risen. Extract. Hippie. Coat of Arms. Great. Good. Good pull. Another form of the dragon. Doubling up. Doubling up on that form of the dragon. Box is like, I know what you like. I know you like red dragons. And I'm all like, no, no, not really, bro. Not really. You got me all wrong. Ooh, nice whisper. Search for tomorrow. Jungle barrier. Come on. Is that a common? Yeah, it's a common. So saying, okay, good uncommon. And Mirren of Clan Neltoth. That's a cool, uh... That's a cool mythic. Not giant money hit, but but that's a cool hit. And the Reaper King. Too bad Scarecrows are never really a thing. Huh? Pep. 
Path to Exile to start us off. Okay. Knight of Cliffhaven. Yep, nine tailed white fox. Yeah, cards, stuff, things. Yep. Ancestral mask. Oops. Old G giant growth. Treacherous terrain. Gray pelt refuge. What are you? You are meh. Chancellor of the Annex, huh? Are you an angel or are you an Eldrazi angel? Seriously. And Odric, before he turned into a vampire. And the Yortiller Nephilim. All right, halfway through the box after this pack. Yep. I don't think I've ever really ever truly seen somebody taking a pound town on one of these. That might be happening here. All right, Blightning, Milliken, Knight of Dawn, yep, Knight Howler. Eh, send triplets, okay, take that. Not worth what it was when these came out, but still. Realize I'm going to need another spot for uh, Inferno Jet Magma Spray. Okay, Destructor Dragon. Common, uncommon, common, uncommon, common. Higher Spire, High Spire Mantis. Okay, Serrated Arrows. I remember you. All right, Dolmen Gate. I have no idea what you are. You're obviously from Lorwyn. That doesn't seem half bad, actually. I don't even know if it's a good hit, but I'm going to put it there. All right, Mind Spring. Stormcrow. <laughs> really? Stormcrow. Really? You had to add that to... Okay. Wizards and their storm crows. Peace of mind. Merfolk Luda. Fireball. Raging Sword of Tooth. Universal Solvent and Brimstone Mage. That's not a rare. Is that a rare? No. Is that a rare? I cannot tell. Is that an uncommon? I think it's an uncommon. Okay. Tireless Tracker. Okay. That's not too shabby. Take that. And Pili Pala. Now I'm just going to start putting commons over on the side there. Lincoln Zealot, Tectonic Edge, Guided Passage from Apocalypse, huh? Stay. Urza's Rage. That, that was a rare at one point. Okay. And Greater Moss Dog. Coming. All right, last pack of the middle, folks. I have to admit, my hopes are dead at this point. So at this point, we're just opening packs, and we'll see what we get out of this, because there's no turning back. I could be pleasantly surprised, but right now, I'm not feeling that way. Gutter Snipe. The Gitrog Monster. Cool card. Spell Tithe Enforcer. Yeah, it's a rare. Okay, last eight packs, folks. Come on, I need a, I need to find some spice. And I don't know what spice to say to hit because there's way too many cards to hit. 
Animate dead, cool. Battle Rage, Overgrown Battle Mint, Armament Corpse, Forgotten Cave, ah, Defense of the Heart, that's a neat one. Not Again, not, not the kind of hit that's going to... Grasp of Fate, huh? Interesting card. And Bramblewood Paragon. Curiosity. Grave Digger. Chatter Spree. Cool card. Chatter Spree. Yep. Okay. Elves of the Deep Shadow. That's not bad. Light Frontier was that Vioac? So it's one of the uh, what do they what do they call this? It's just obviously they come into play tapped, but still. Mana Tithe. Alhamrat's archive, that's cool. I'll take that. It's another mythic. And Witch Bane Orb. We're not doing well in that slot. I have done well in that slot in past boxes. In fact, I I remember one box where that spot carried the box. And Cabal Therapy, okay. <laughs> Eternal Witness is in this too, huh? All right. Frogmite. Meddling Mage. Just have to meddling mage. Oh, ah, grave crawler. That's actually a pretty good one right there. That's actually a really good one, isn't it? Maelstrom Nexus. Okay, that is a mythic. We're getting mythics in that area. Not necessarily the ones you want, but in fact, I would say the rares overall are kind of like the bigger hits. But whatever. Let me just slide things up here so we have space. There we go. So we are running out of uh, runway here. So let's hope that we finally find a big hit or two. Belligerent, Brontodon. Okay, Gruel Signet. Tower of Eons, huh? Uh huh. I remember Meriden. This did not get played. Deadly Tempest. You, I don't know. That's kind of neat. I don't know if it's a hit, but that's kind of neat. Yeah, <laughs> Celestial Karen. Yep, that was a card. Four packs left, folks. At this point, we need a Mana Crypt. Actually, can I, wasn't Rhystic Study in here too at Common? Of course, Common in this set doesn't really mean Common. Yeah. Lightning Helix. Sorcerer's Broom. <laughs> Archangel, okay. Prey Caesar Dragon, huh? From one of the plain... Uh, what do they call these sets? Plain Chase or whatever it is. And a second Lich's Mirror, because duplication. Alright. I do apologize, folks, for those that kind of want me to be positive all the time. This, this box isn't going well at all. So, positivity is definitely... Uh, Lacking at the moment. And not that I even expect a home run when I go into the box. I think I make that pretty clear. But 
Eldrazi Devastator, Crystal Shard, Mystic's Mastery, okay, and Karthus. Well, it's a mythic. Wait, they just add like all the mythics from Shards of Alara. Is that what they did? Two packs left, folks. Can we get lucky? Because at this point, it's dumb luck needed. Retreat to Amiria. Guild Gay. Uh, what are you? Sajiri Refuge. Oh, it's your one of you. One of you. Okay. Draco, the OG. Look at that 16 casting cost. That is silly. Tower on the Sky Summoner. Oh, God. You just have to troll me, don't you? That's what we're doing here. Wait a minute. I had cards here? What are these cards? Hold on. Why did I have cards there? Are these just commons? Yeah, there's commons. Okay. So yeah, Tall Round the Sky Summoner in Mind Funeral. Last pack, everybody. Last pack, and we're going to come to a merciful ending here. Vengeful Rebirth with different art. Thought Vessel, okay. Dragon Brood Mother, another Alara. Is that, is that, I don't know which, I don't know all the Alaras, but I know it's from that period. Ugh, the Arch. And Aurelia's Fury to finish this off with a Gate Crash Mythic. Well, that's a whole bunch of ouch, folks. Um, thank you for watching. Appreciate it. Glad you can go on this ride to Pound Town with me. I don't think I've ever seen this before out of one of these, but here we are. All right, bye.